Hey, Jennifer. Hi, Greg. How are you? Hey, hey how are you? How's Aiden? Good. Um, he's doing really well. He um, yeah. he's a little bit like his back is straightening out really nicely. Nice. Um, I'm away right now, but he told me because he just went to the chiropractor. He had a little bit of inflammation on the left side when he went, but um, yeah. I think I mean he's really straightening out nicely and um, very good, growing nicely. So we just keep at it and uh, with everything that we're doing. Um, good, good, good. And he's he's growing. He's still on the deer antler. Um. So, so far, so good. Yeah. Good. Good. It's good. really good. Yeah. I'm so so glad. Um. You. Yeah. It's 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 awesome. So we just keep going in the right direction here. Um. I I'm really, uh, actually asking a question for my on behalf of my daughter. Sure. Sure. <laughs> Um, she has this, uh, she has teenage acne going on and it's okay. not, it, it's, it's like, it comes and it goes like, um, she's doing, she's real cognizant about, um, eating really well, like staying mm. away from anything that would be triggers for her, like sugar or dairy sure, or, sure, sure, sure. or, uh, gluten or anything. And, um, I actually have a lot of, I have, Ayurvedic herbs that I make a mm -hmm. tea out of and she's on that con constantly like she's always making the tea for herself this is really good at cleaning out the system and um, helping to regulate the body so she's just getting really frustrated because um, there's just certain points like on her chin and yeah. on her certain cheeks just, that just yeah. Yeah. They just won't stop. They just keep yeah. coming back. And it's, it's, she's working so hard at this that it becomes like this huge stressor for her because she yeah. feels like she's doing everything and then they return. So we were so both I, like I, I would talking say the other night things. and I thought maybe I'll ask. Yeah. I'd say a couple of things. Like, so for one, like, you know, it's, it's the kind of the cliche thing, like with teenagers, it's the hormonal thing which is true, but it just still doesn't mean that things can't be done to, to go through and treat it. And anytime you see acne, be it on the face or anywhere on the body, like think of it as like, it's, it's, um, it's your body's like emergency way of detoxifying something out of the body. And, you know, here it's just like hormonal hormones and hormonal shifts and things like that. And so, you could try a couple of different things. One, I would do like a couple drops of helichrysum and like whatever, however she washes her face at night. Like I'd put a couple drops in that and then, you know, really rub it in. And you could even put um, helichrysum directly on the spots. <clears throat> tea tree will work, but this is what I would say about tea tree. Tea tree will, will draw the acne at, like out, or like bring it to a head and make a pop and everything. But I, I kind of don't like to do that sometimes just because, you know, if there's a lot of it, there's a greater potential for like scarring and things like that, you know, because you're, you're bringing it to a head. I kind of prefer to, to like diminish it somewhat, you know, just like calm uh -huh. down the inflammation. And then the other thing that I would do is I would use like a, a blood purifier. Um, I'm trying to think which one would be best for her. She doesn't have any autoimmune issue that you're aware of or anything like that. No. Mm -mm. I, I I would probably do um, a back and forth between like a drop or two of German chamomile and water and drink it and then like let a couple of days go by <laughs> and then do it again. But in between that, I would use... Um, uh, echinacea. I, I, you could use St. John's wort, but just just because she's young and she's going to be outside and she's going to be in the sun, like St. John's wort, she might have a little bit of reaction to the sun. And I don't even want her to have to think about like, do I go out in the sun? Do I not? You know, all that stuff. Echinacea is just mm -hmm. easier to, to use there. And the thing with echinacea, you're not, it's not really about infection is that echinacea is actually a really good blood purifier and it's just helping to clean up the blood. You know, it could be something going on with the liver. It could be the body's just changing and shifting. So, um, 
you know, the, the helichrysum should be a good like topical thing that can be done. And then the, um, a little bit of German chamomile. The German chamomile, the reason why I like the German chamomile for this is it helps to clean up um, <clears throat> me, um, like metabolical, metabolic processes. Um, you know, so if there's been an infection or if there's um, toxic material in some, some area, German chamomile cleans it up really well. And then in between that, the echinacea would just keep cleaning it out. And so you don't have to go real hard or massive on the German chamomile, but it's very anti-inflammatory. It cleans things up. And if she felt like she was in a really bad crisis, she could even put a couple of drops, you know, it's dark blue. So like she'll want to do this at night and put it on something, wh yeah. in whatever she puts on her face at night sometimes. And she could put it on her face and it would reduce some of the the inflammation and help clean things up like topically. But um, I, I would probably just start with it, okay. see how it does. And she can put like a drop or two in juice and just call it good. The, the echinacea so could be a uh, tincture or it could be capsules, however, but just echinacea by itself, nothing else. Okay. Okay. So you you would take echinacea internally. Yeah. Do the German cam chamomile uh, in some water, maybe every couple of days. Yeah, and like probably every two to maybe three days. Topically like, as well. Um, especially if it's like if the heliprism's not working, like I would step it up with the German chamomile. So heliprism on the spots, heliprism. Um, couple drops when she's washing her face. Helichrysum on the spots and helichrysum and like whatever she washes her face with at night. Have her just put a couple drops in and lather up and then okay. put it on her face and let it sit there for a minute or two. And then if there's spots that are really flaring up, she could just take a, a drop, dab it, and then just put it on neat on the spots. Okay. It usually will this... take the inflammation down pretty good. And is this just like... Um... Like start this like as soon as she gets it, and then yeah, oh continue. yeah, I would, start it, I would start it immediately until she outgrows it, and then just until just keep it consistent until she outgrows it. Okay, yeah, yeah. I mean, okay, it and the doesn't German last for, too. Yeah, it, it usually doesn't last okay. for a super long time, but I mean, it could be a thing that happens for a few years. Okay, yeah. all right. Then we'll I'll do that, and I'm wondering because I'm thinking maybe I'll just. Do a bunch of German chamomile again and get Aiden back on it because he was off of it for a little bit. And I thought, well, maybe he's inflamed because he needs a little bit more. Um, um if, if he's it, I mean the friggin' and myrrh is pretty solid. Um, but if he's still yeah. having a little flare up, you could put it on the on the spots, you know, like or just sure. have a little extra internal from time to time. It does reduce sure. things down really quickly. The thing that I like yeah. about the chamomile and the helichrysum as well, especially for your daughter, is that you're treating the area, but you're also like, you know, helichrysum is a very good uh, free radical scavenger. So it helps uh -huh. even like kind of the precursors that turn into inflammation and things like that. And then both the helichrysum and the German chamomile are both also very good for the liver. And so okay. sometimes there's a little bit of a liver issue when there's acne. And that's part of why the acne is busting out in the different areas. And sure. um, it kind of hits all, hits all the spots. Okay. Yeah. All right. Awesome. We'll do that. Thank good, you good, so good. much. Yeah, good Appreciate all yeah. the help.